this Swiss international footballer is a bona fide mathematics prodigy. Take a moment to visualize this. A bustling TV studio in Switzerland, the bright lights, the hushed anticipation. At the center of it all, Manuel Akanji, relaxed and confident. Not in his usual football gear, but ready for a different kind of competition. A mathematics challenge on live television. Against him, the show's host armed with a calculator, ready to take on the footballer in a numbers game. What happened next was nothing short of remarkable. With each problem presented, Akanji, with his sharp mind and quicker wit, solved them in his head even before the host could punch the numbers into the calculator. The studio audience watched in awe as this footballer, known for his prowess on the field, demonstrated a whole new set of skills, proving his extraordinary mathematical abilities. This event was a testament to the diverse talents of Akanji. He's not just a footballer who's made a name for himself at Manchester City and the Swiss national team, He's also a math whiz who can give seasoned mathematicians a run for their money. It's a rare combination, making Akanji a unique figure in the world of football. But how does his mathematical acumen translate to his football career? Well, just as he calculates and solves problems on live TV, Akanji applies the same precision and quick thinking on the pitch. His ability to analyze the game, anticipate moves and make split-second decisions is arguably influenced by his mathematical mind. His game is a perfect blend of physical prowess and mental agility, making him a formidable player. So there you have it, Manuel Akanji, the footballer who's as comfortable with numbers as he is with a football at his feet. His story is a reminder that our talents are diverse and limitless. And who knows, maybe the next time... 3201. <laughs> 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 Von wo kommt das? Von wo kommt das? Training? Oder? Ähm, ja, es ist wirklich Training. Ich habe mich früher in der Schule schon viel mit Zahlen beschäftigt und der Lehrer, den ich hatte, hat auch viel Wettbewerb gemacht, dass man immer gegeneinander hat, äh, muss antreten musste. Das habe ich eigentlich immer gewonnen. Aber ähm, ich habe mich... Die Leistung, die ich habe dann auch irgendwie, sage ich jetzt, bei Autoschildern oder weiss auch nicht, irgendwie bei Zahlen habe ich mir automatisch eigentlich daraus immer Rechnungen gemacht. Ich weiß selber nicht wieso, aber ich habe mich dann durch das kann ich mir dann gewisse Zahlen merken, wie jetzt zum Beispiel, wenn sie 33 mal 97 sagt, rechne ich entweder 33 mal 90 und das weiß ich einfach halt schon auswendig, oder 33 mal 100 und dann rechne ich so noch so andere dazu. Und 